we have reiterated that terrorism has no particular face or image and cannot be linked to any group of people, religion or culture. We have stated clearly that all acts of terrorism are against the divine teachings of Islam. We have stressed that terrorism is a global problem and there is a need for us to take a collective action and do a collective effort in combating terrorism at the international level within the United Nations framework. The population sectarian, the interpreters, countries of whom allow me to say that we express our sincere thanks. The Israeli military action clearly demonstrates the practice of state terrorism. We have urged the international community to assume its responsibility in putting an end to the Israeli military aggression and have called for the immediate and total withdrawal of all Israeli forces from the occupied territories. The fight will continue. There is no other mean with the Israeli government. Only to continue our struggle until we will achieve our objective in independent and establishment of the Palestinian state with its capital, Jerusalem. The U.S. is the only power in the world that could stop this carnage, that could prevent killings from being continued. So that, I think there is a very uh, definite call on wanting to see this uh, continued violence stop. Washington. I believe this conference did achieve the substantial and substantive results it set out to achieve. We never wanted to achieve anything more in this conference, and I believe there is unanimity within the conference on the elements that uh, have been drafted in the declaration on the need to fight terrorism and on the need to define terrorism. It is a terrorist criminal campaign staged by Israel against the Palestinian people. Thank you. What is